Today we are talking tacos. Not just any old tacos, tacos for breakfast. One of my favorite to-go breakfast meals. I am a really big fan of breakfast. I could have it probably three times a day if I could. My family might not like that. Well, actually my daughter. My daughter is a big fan of breakfast too, so when it's just us two home, this is something that we make and like I said, we could probably eat it three times a day if possible. So stick around. I'm going to go over all of the ingredients. I'm going to use about three eggs. I use one whole egg and two egg whites. These two eggs are actually from my chickens because I do have chickens. So they are organic, but if you want, you can use egg whites um, or all whole eggs. Shredded cheese. A tomato, a slice of a tomato, sour cream, and that's about, I want to say, a tablespoon and a half, a tablespoon and a half of salsa, half of an avocado, salt and pepper. You can also use shredded lettuce if you'd like. I usually don't put that in there, but you can. Um, and these are two sizes of tortillas that I have. The softer one is 90 calories, which is what I use, I try to go with. <laughs> but on days that I'm really, really hungry, I use a bigger size tortilla. Oops, those are coming out. And those are these larger ones. And for those of you that are counting calories, uh, 140 calories just for one. I honestly just make one of these and one of these breakfast tacos fills me up. Let's get started. Okay, so I have heated up my pan here with a little bit of coconut oil. You can use regular butter if you would like. I just prefer to use the coconut oil because I'm trying to watch everything that I eat. And once that is heated up, you can add your eggs to that. And again, I'm doing one full egg. I'm doing one whole egg. And then I'm going to be doing the egg whites. These are my chicken eggs, and they tend to be, the yolk tends to be very strong. So I rarely use the whole yolk when I cook with these eggs. So we'll let that cook up. And I like to make these with the yolk a little bit soft. Not too runny, but just soft. Okay, I think that is ready to flip over. On the other side, to add a little bit of salt to that, and a little bit of pepper. So now what I usually do, is right about now, I turn off my stove because it's eggs cook pretty fast. So my stove is now turned off and now I'm going to start adding all the rest of my ingredients. While that pan is still hot, I'm going to lift these guys up, throw my tortilla in there. I love putting my tortilla in there right now because it, it won't burn, it'll get toasty. And then I just throw all my, throw the cheese on top, so that's all going to melt. Start adding everything, everything to my eggs, to, to my tortilla, while it's still in that pan. I'm going to add this half of an avocado. I love avocado. I think I buy 
a bag every week when I go out shopping. <laughs> and we're going to add our salsa. Yum, yum, yum. And the salsa already has tomatoes in it, but because I love tomatoes, I add a little bit more tomatoes in there. Again, really, you could put whatever you want in this. Whatever your little heart desires that you like in an omelet, you like in a breakfast sandwich. And the bottom of this tortilla, ooh, it's gotten toasty. That's exactly what I wanted. And this is ready to serve. I haven't put the sour cream on top yet. I like to do that at the end. So we are going to... That is... That is hot, so you got to be careful with it. There we go. So the last part is adding sour cream. Ta-da! Now this is a meal, let me tell you. I just need to eat one of these and I'm good. There you have it guys, there's your breakfast taco. And I am gonna dig into this. Mmm. So good. So if you are a breakfast person, you gotta try this. It is absolutely yummy and it's very filling. All right, guys. Have a great day. Have an awesome morning. Hey, guys. I didn't get a chance to write my food for thought um, like I usually do on my board. Instead, I wanted to share something with you. I read from this um, book. It is God's Message for Each Day by Eugene H. Peterson. And I just wanted to read this. First of all, the verse is Psalms 37, 5. Open up before God. Keeps nothing back. He'll do whatever needs to be done. And it goes on to read, We live in a noisy world. We are yelled at, promoted, called. Everyone has an urgent message for us. We are surrounded with noise, telephone, radio, television, stereo, internet. The world is a mob in which everyone is talking at once and no one is willing or able to listen. But God listens, not only speaks to us, he listens to us. His listening to us is an even greater marvel than his speaking to us. It is rare to find anyone who listens carefully and thoroughly. When it happens, we know that what we say and feel are immensely important. We acquire dignity. We never know how well we think or speak until we find someone who listens. And so my food for thought for today is God does listen, even when we sometimes think that he's not and he's too busy answering other prayers or listening to everybody else. He does listen. Sometimes we just have to pull ourselves away and find a place, you know, that's quiet, that you can reflect. Sometimes we need to do that because life just gets so busy and sometimes we just need that, to find that place where it's quiet and you can hear him. And I just tell you that that is what gets me through the day is when I have that connection. So I have, hope you have a great day and God bless.